Hey guys, I'm Necroviathan, and I want to talk about Once Human. Now, I really wanted this to do well. Now, I've played a lot of this game. I've played a cl uh, close to almost like 100 hours into this game for the beta time that was open to the first day it was released to the very end. Now, I've done tons of raids. I ran up to like all the levels. I got all the special things. I got all the grade four weapons, and I did as many raids as I could. It was, of course, with a group of friends that I ended up meeting towards the end of the uh, beta. However, um, this game has a lot of potential. I'm really happy for it, and I wanted to do well. I It'd be coming up probably third quarter of this year coming up, and these are some of the things I came into. I wanted to show you a little bit about the game. The game is not perfect, okay? But I do want to show you some of the funny moments and other things that have had this game an impact of just things they might need to work on in Blunt Human. I really want them to do well, but I'm not going to allow them to get away with certain things that can easily be fixed, you know? So I made this little video to kind of just do it. And uh, if you are coming to my first channel, be sure if you like my video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all the good stuff, and I will definitely keep up with you in the shorter videos. But here, before I do, here's all the little skits that I found, all those ridiculous moments that when I was streaming uh, didn't turn out as way as it should have. But here you go. With the uh, the Eldritch Horror disease, and uh, she, this is her, her transformation. She's like a butterfly. She, she, but you seem so confident. She's gonna be a beautiful butterfly one day. I said I wanted to take on that great one. She's just cocooning. This is part of the process. <laughs> this is the part of the game that I regretfully say started to break. It was a tip of the iceberg where the game is no longer fully fleshed. Because everything was perfect up until this very point where her eyes just started bugging out. Um, after the point, the entire game started aggressively breaking down. Anything from walking glitches to falling through the map to characters just completely de-rezzing their entire clothing, causing bugs where they're completely naked and it was not safe for a stream. There were uh, cars re-rezzing. There were monsters flying across the map. There was so many different things. My whole, like... There were times I had to completely restart the game, come back into it. There were times where sometimes the buttons wouldn't work. Sometimes, like, everything just went haywire after this point. And I will literally show you after this point, it only gets worse. Here you go. Your <laughs> discretion is advised. My jaw nearly dropped when you said that was your plan. My jaw nearly <laughs> dropped just seeing your eyes pop out of your head. You're no ordinary mayfly. You're not even an ordinary metahuman. You're not even an ordinary person. <laughs> Something far beyond us ordinary mortals. Oh my god. Oh, why does it keep going back to default of her eyes popping out of her head? Why is this happening? <laughs> Glad her eyes returned. Jeez. Kind of odds you were facing. Even my own goal of shutting down this monolith. The amount of work and tech looks even. I have a pill on me. A cyanide pill. You should take that cyanide pill immediately after the, experiencing that thing. Everyone oh my god. Dead. Oh. I didn't want to use it. Once human is not a broken game. It doesn't have any bugs. That's a part of the Eldritch horse. <laughs> I can't breathe. I can't breathe. <laughs> Once humans is not a broken game. This is part of it. This is part of the game, guys. This is supposed to happen. This is this is this is part of the game, guys. This is this is part of I think you know, as long as the securement's above fifty percent you can turn the box off and you don't need to have it powered and you still get the uh long time no see greenbeard all right pal hold it right there oh god he's naked yourself. Why was he naked? Did you ever hear of the Mayflies? 
I'm here to solve problems, not cause them. Oh, yeah. Backpacks. A uh, cradle, right? We had another one of you guys come by here not too long ago. He didn't exactly impress anyone. So, you here to clean up his mess? We've got a pretty urgent stardust problem. He didn't impress anyone? How many metahumans are there? I know you'll actually help. I can't promise anything, but I'll try if let well, me in. I can't make any promises if I don't know what's going on. It's like going to the doctor. You've got Would you trust a killer clown? You Would you trust well, a killer clown? At least you're a better talker. Than I'm just a psycho murder killer clown. It's fine. Hold on a sec. I'm gonna check with the mayor. I'm right here. Let the oh mayor God. in. Oh Hello. She just fucking teleported in your face. <laughs> What the fuck is going on with this game? <laughs> Have babies right now in this apocalyptic world. <laughs> Sounds like it'd be more hurting than helping. Oh god, she's broken. She's broken. Oh no. Oh god. <laughs> oh no. So this is where the game is not fleshed. You would think just the beta would be fleshed. But oh my god. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> He's got polio or something. Parkinson's? I don't know what was up with that. Jeez. Guys all go. Yeah, this whole like society of mayflies, it's like they know who we are, but we don't. We seem to know less about ourselves and the rest of the people. Like the average civilian, which seems to know more about a top secret organization than the actual top secret organization. It seems like, because I guess we're like we have amnesia or some shit. But there's been a boom in market demand since. Are you in charge of this settlement? That's right. They call me Hot Dog. I'm the interim acting mayor here. Nice to meet you. Why do they call you Hot Dog? Because I like hot dogs. Also because people were messing around with my actual name, Doug. Oh, I should tell you that the official leader of Greywater is the head of the oil workers union, Dennis Mobley. But he was called oh, to no, deal with Oh no, this guy's face Blackfield. needs some and really fucking touching back. off. And I guess I'm the best they could come up with to take his place. Oh my god, it looks so bad. <laughs> is this even alcohol? Here, you want something to drink? It's not exactly fine wine, but it'll do. Cheers. The best moonshine gray water has to offer. Now, we All the dialogues backwards and just... This keeps our it's not going ahead. Some uh, dialogues behind you know, fucking dialogue decisions, so great, which doesn't make any oh, sense. Like like bars with, uh, the helmet off the movie. Yeah, yeah! No, you're right! Yeah, Total Recall, when they, uh, they couldn't breathe because of, uh, yeah, because the fan was shut off and they were ejected into the, the surface. Yeah. She was once human. <laughs> Who knows what she is now? She's a meta-human. This is what happens when you become a meta-human. She's actually infected with the uh, the Eldridge Horror Disease, and uh, she's this is her her transformation. She's like a butterfly. She, she... But you seem so <laughs> She's gonna be a beautiful butterfly one day. I said I wanted to take on that great one. She's just, just cocooning. This is part of the process. <laughs> Mayflies used to help survivors and deal with the deviations or deviants, but taking on a great one. It's unheard of. My jaw nearly dropped when you said that was your plan. My jaw nearly dropped just...